Headline is fast approaching for a school voucher petition that's been circulating throughout Arizona. If the group leading the petition gets enough signatures, the school voucher expansion may be halted here in our state. News for Tucson's Eric Fink is live in central Tucson with the details. Eric. Sean, good evening. The group Save Our Schools Arizona, the group against school vouchers, trying to get this measure in front of Arizona voters once again. And as you can see, some parents and teachers out here tonight, here at Himmel Park, collecting signatures. The group says they're planning to be pushing hard until the very last second, trying to get every last petition signature up until noon tomorrow. Save Our Schools Arizona, a nonpartisan community group supporting public schools, has to turn in at least 118,000 valid voter signatures to the Secretary of State's office in Phoenix by 3 o'clock tomorrow. If they're successful, the school voucher expansion will be stopped from taking effect on Saturday. If that happens, experts expect a long legal fight over whether the voucher expansion will be sent back to voters for a final say in 2024. Governor Doug Ducey signed the nation's largest school voucher bill back in July. The expansion makes every Arizona student eligible for $7,000 a year to pay for private, religious, or homeschooling. The initiative is funded by taxpayers. The Save Our Schools Arizona director, Beth Lewis, says she's had thousands of volunteers circulating petitions against vouchers for the last eight and a half weeks, while the director of the American Federation for Children, a group supporting school choice, says they're following the battle closely. With only 80 days to do this Herculean effort, we know that we're going to be cutting it close. We're trying to build every cushion we can because there are going to be huge legal battles that we're going to have to fight by, you know, national special interests. So we are down to the wire trying to collect every last signature up until noon on Friday. We would certainly be interested in finding out are the signatures uh, valid? Are they plentiful? <laughs> are there any errors? Were there any uh, was there any inconsistencies in how they collected them? Uh, so so we would, at, at any point in time, our organization is always ready to defend and fight on behalf of the best interests for parents. So if they do get them, if they don't get them, it's not going to change our mission. Now, Save Our Schools have been collecting signatures on petitions since early July. They are optimistic they can hit their target number of nearly 119,000 signatures by tomorrow. Now remember, Arizona voters already turned down voter uh, voucher expansion, that is, with nearly 65 percent of voters saying no at the polls in 2018. This effort, this petition effort, is a chance to try to put this back to the ballot for voters in November of 2024. We're live tonight here at Himmel Park in central Tucson. I'm Eric Fink, News 4 Tucson.